Good morning. Good morning, good people. So today we are doing a quick test vlog on this Sony A5000 camera. The image on the screen looks really crappy, so I don't know how the footage will look, but I think it will look pretty good because the photos look pretty good. I'm going to a quick shoot at a corporate doing headshots, and then we're going to go do some content with Pavia. So I'm just going to take you on the trip. I'm not taking a mic or anything, so this is onboard sound. Uh, settings are as is, and we are going to just try this out. No filter or anything, and then um, have a little bit of a talk about what we think about the footage. Anyway, let me get going before I'm late. So we just arrived here at Stradafin. We are going to go see where we can shoot, then come fetch the gear, set it up everywhere, and then um, and then and then, and then shoot. I'm gonna leave the GoPro just chilling there, and maybe it will be making some cool behind the scenes for you guys. And then um, I'm go not the GoPro, the Osmo action. And then go from there to we to Pavia's house. Mickey's also coming up. She's probably not gonna be on camera. Let's do that. I hope this is not too weird of a vlog, or it sounds bad. But I wanted to test the quality of this A5000 camera. That's what I wanted to do. So just test it quick and then see how it works. Um, the screen puts you off right away. You go, you kind of go, what the f is wrong with my screen? But anyway, we are just going to go in, we're going to tell her we uh, check some locations and then put the gear up and then do a quick. It's like nine people. It's not going to take long. Anyway, see you guys there. Peace. <laughs> to location scout now while they finish makeup. they will cool this room then. Okay, so it's starting off, oh, hold on, really well. Uh, Adele seems very nice and so does the owner of the place. Um, we are going to set up in the like boardroom thing. We're gonna do full length shots, not, not head shots because they want something different. Uh, so I've just gotta figure out how to set the lighting up in that small little passage thing. But, not bad, looks, looks decent to me. So we are going to just pack up our stuff See if Mickey's close by so she can walk in with me and then uh, yeah, head on to the next one. I'm sure she is. So we're done with the headshots. We are a little bit too early for Pavia, so we are going to go get coffee quick and then head to Pavia for her shoot for you guys, for content for YouTube. I did film on the Osmo Action as behind the scenes, which you probably saw before this, but I, it turned off halfway through because I was filming 4K30 and obviously the battery doesn't last that long. I should have probably done a time-lapse mode, which that's my, my fault. But anyway, um, I hope you guys enjoyed that piece of behind the scenes. We are going to get some coffee now and then we are going to Pavia. We're going to shoot the next part of this. I hope this footage looks good. It actually doesn't look too bad on the screen right now, which is nice. Anyway, I shall see you guys uh, when we get there. When the world goes back to normal. Well, when the holidays happen, I guess. No, that the world will never go back to normal. Okay, so we are here by Pavia now. This is her dance studio. I'm going to try to introduce you to her, but it's very echoey in there. So I'm just filming this outside quickly. I'm going to do two videos, one using this A5000 um, to show you you can do professional shots with us. We're actually going to do natural light with a diffuser. And uh, the other video is going to be my A7 III. And I think we're going to use the V1 to do beauty shots. I think that's the, the goal here. V1 beauty shot with a flash from the bottom. I think that's the goal here. Anyway, let me introduce you to Pavia. There's the job. Pavia. <laughs> Hello. This is the <a> studio. 
Why are you guys so shy on camera? I'm not. Tell people what you do. We dance, we barely dance, yeah. Um, it is I'm home <laughs> and I miss it very much. Can they follow you on Instagram? You can follow me on Instagram and have you and Rosie Belly Dance. Okay, so we're gonna get off this camera because I'm gonna use it and then I'll see you later. How was the V1? It was awesome. Are you going to buy one? I think I might, just maybe. <laughs> Alright, so we are done with uh, Pavia. It took a bit longer than normal. And we had a bit of issues because I was trying to slave the V1 with the A5000 and it wasn't working. So, yeah. I do have a theory on why it wasn't working. Because the, the flash takes so long to recycle on the V1. Uh, on the A6A5000 that the there's a delay now right and it, and it didn't want to fire so so we changed it and we just made it a natural light shoot and this is obviously the A5000 test as a, a vlogging camera which is pretty cool it actually looks quite nice if you put the screen on sunny uh, sunny whatever so you can see it in, in the sun then it looks really bad but now it looks pretty good so we're gonna head home we're gonna get some lunch and yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying the content. I'm trying to make much more regular content so that uh, you guys get some behind the scenes and stuff. I really enjoy the behind the scenes photo shoots, but a lot of people enjoy the vlogs and some like the retouching. So let me know which ones you want me to do more of and then we go from there. Yeah. Okay, so we're home. Um, camera's actually been doing quite a while. As long as you don't turn on sunny mode, like the sunny mode preview is really crappy compared to the A6400. But right now it looks really good. I would like this as a camera. Getting a mic on your sucks. You probably have to. What I think you must do is mic your yourself with a lapel mic, plug it into your phone, and just leave it because you have your phone in your pocket anyway, and just record audio all the time, and then um, sync it later. But anyway, let's see how this looks on the computer. Okay, so future Rob here. Um, I just finished editing the vlog, so I just wanted to throw in a few quick thoughts on the camera. Um, the the screen flipping up, big plus compared to the A6000, which is a similar camera, but you can't see what you're doing. However, if you are using the screen out like in the brightness like this, the screen looks really bad. It doesn't portray what the actual footage is gonna look like. That's a problem. And then if you put it on sunny mode, which is just easier to see the screen then, then it looks horrible. It's like the, the, the darks go really dark and the brights go really bright. You can't see what's going on. It looks very bad. The footage obviously doesn't look so bad because you've seen it before this. The one thing I see is I turned off noise reduction but it seems like the shots in the house and in the car my skin looks like super smooth and I think that's from the noise reduction fixing the, the noise. So there's that. The audio is not horrible. You can hear those eyelids are still on there but the audio in general is not horrible when it's when it's quiet like this. And then yeah that's pretty much pretty much it. Uh, the face tracking seems to work fine. The, the, the quality of the image is fine. It's just uh, it's a small, very light camera. We did use the kit lens for all of this, so um, this is the cheapest lens you can get. I can maybe do another vlog where I put like my 16mm 1.4 on here, so it's more of an expensive lens on a cheap camera. But I wanted to throw this in just so there's an ending to the video. And then I think we're just going to jump onto comments to end the video off with Michelle. So uh, yeah, let's do that. And thanks for watching. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, and then let us know where you want us to go, what you want us to do, what other tests you want on this camera before we give it away. This will be a giveaway camera probably to do with my Instagram. So to, to get my Instagram to like whatever, 20,000 followers or something stupid, we'll do something like that and then I give this away to an Instagram person rather than a YouTube person. We are still giving away the A6000 on my YouTube so please go check out that video. And yeah, thanks for coming. Alright, that is up. Here's Michelle as promised Stop. for comments. Okay, so vlog. We, we had the one where my car broke. By the way, what we are filming this with is, uh, this is a uh, Godox 8300, just putting light on the side. That shadow is from, that shadow is from the Godox, and then the window's open on that side. And then we're still on the A5000, because that's what the vlog's about. So we're gonna keep filming. So the audio might not sound great, but it's 
because it's this camera. How many thumbs up can we get on this comment to get Michelle to wax Rob's nose? That's How many thumbs uncle. up did they get? Four. Only four. Only four for Shane. I need, the rest like, of you. I need like 50. Ready? If you, That's if you, my nose, bro. If you give him a number, he, he's going to get it there. He's going to get everyone to go onto that video. No. Okay, so AJ says, nice vlog, bro. Stay safe. Sweaty Confetti says, do you prefer the Osmo Action over the GoPro? Um, I can't say because I don't have a GoPro to try, but my old GoPro, it's the same thing. It's a camera you can throw everywhere. You don't like it because it's too wide. Mm. But it's nice for like when you don't, when you can't take this with. So for now, we like it. And then I think when we do travel vlogs, we'll like it more because we can get in the water and stuff. Ped says, man, you're getting more and more gear. Well, yeah, but that's a problem. I do sell my old gear to get the new gear. I don't just buy new gear and it sits there. So everything I own, I use. I get rid of the stuff that I upgrade from. Veronique says, nice vlog. Got to visit that shop. Very cool. Which shop? Oh, the, the yeah. pants shop. This awesome pants shop. Yay, yeah, new vlog, Jasmine. Where's your new vlog? Miss Grace says, you must teach me how to vlog, bro. I forgot to look at the damn lens. So that's my sister. Yeah, it's tricky. I still don't look at the lens. I look like just between the lens and the... Where do you look? At yourself? I don't know. I, I don't really I look at myself. Most of the time when I, if I'm in the car with you and I'm vlogging my own, I'm actually looking at myself. Yeah. I'm not looking at the camera camera. Although I've gotten a bit better in that I only... Like I look up every now and then at the screen just to check what's happening yeah. and that everything's I, I like gaze at the middle part. Uh, okay, so this was the the vlog on the Osmo as a test. So it was a really small one. So we've got uh, Ped saying the mic is decent but the stabilization is superb. It's so steady and it's so wide. I don't like that so wide. Really. The wide just makes you not be able to be cinematic but it, it's, it's okay. At least just point in the direction. Uh, Hung Dizzle, that's a cool name. Hung Dizzle, because he's hung like a dizzle. <laughs> he's new, I don't recognize the name. I still prefer the DJ Osmo action for my shooting over bigger cameras, rock steady for the win, uh, and super wide. And the low, just oh, just the low, like, yeah. So the minute you get into the dark, the camera pushes that ISO really high. So if you can force it to be lower, so we set it to 400 or so, but um, yeah, it's. It's nice. I still like my A6400. But anyway, um, thanks for coming, saying hi, leaving a comment. Thank Leave you. a comment on this one, we'll read it on the next one. Yeah. Yeah? Yeah. 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 Don't forget to like and subscribe and click the bell so you can get notified. If you haven't yet, you must check Michelle's channel. Yeah. We're trying so, to get her more into it, but she's, I feel really she's bad. slow. So, um... I have like a job job. It's hard. I have a job job, kind of. You don't have a nine to five. Did you've I kill got a. Recording? You've got a whenever you want to till whenever you want to. Yeah, so go check Michelle's channel out. Yeah, Otherwise stuff's go, coming. Go, We're working on it. Go check me out on Instagram. Also, Michelle tries the internet. Yeah, and I'm planning to do a new channel where I just upload sound effects so people like because I'm looking for sound effects all the time. So I'm gonna record them for myself, but I'll put them up so people can just download them and use them in their videos, and then we'll see how that channel goes. Doesn't have a name yet, or, or it's not up yet, but I'm planning on doing it. What about your graffiti channel? And that one, but there's too many. You have so many ideas. I'm gonna do this one and that one first. But I want graffiti shoes. I'm sorry. Anyway, I'll see you later. Goodbye. Okay,